You're listening to Misunderstanding Dementia Podcast. This episode is brought to you by Misunderstanding Dementia Course, and you can put in 5050 to get a 50% discount on the course. Thank you. Morning, everyone. This is Dr. Mike Chu again, physical therapist, certified dementia practitioner, and uh, author of Misunderstanding Dementia and uh, 365 Daily Tips for Dementia Caregivers. And we have also launched our Misunderstanding Dementia course. If you want to learn more about uh, dementia, how to understand it, what are the causes of dementia, what are the different treatments, you know, what's what are the different types of dementia, our course is available now online at drmichua.com. Well, anyway, uh, I wrote down above, you know, uh, how to uh, how to handle conflict. You know, uh, conflict is just always there. You know, if you got Uh, a patient, uh, a dementia patient, a loved one that is experiencing this disease, there will always be conflict. There will always be arguments. There will always be misunderstanding, you know, misunderstanding dementia. And uh, even Jesus Christ himself said, I come into this world not to uh, give peace, but uh, to come in and give some trials and tribulation. So conflict will always be there. It, it, the, the thing of it is is that you just have to learn how to handle it so there are three things that you need to do and how to handle conflict is first tip or first thing that you need to do is accept the fact that there's always conflict in this world that accept the fact that there will always be misunderstanding especially when taking care of your of a dementia patient so that's the first thing there accepting it second is uh identifying what is the cause of the conflict identifying what is the cause of their behaviors you know uh, why are they mad why are they upset why are they uh, irritated you know it could be a physical problem it could be uh, a emotional problem for your patients it could be they're just irritated because they're uncomfortable in their sitting position so identify what's the root cause of the conflict or the behavior number three is learning how to embrace and learning how to uh, to to know uh, and learn from the actual conflict itself. So if you identified what's making them having some behaviors or conflict, then you can prevent it from happening again. All right. So that's our daily dementia dose tip for you today. Those three things. First, you have to accept the fact there will, that there is always conflict. And second, that you have to know and identify what's causing them, what's causing the behavior. And lastly learn from that behavior learn from it and that way you don't repeat the same mistake again again god bless you i hope you have a great day bye bye you're listening to misunderstanding dementia podcast this episode is brought to you by misunderstanding dementia course and you can put in 50 50 to get a 50 percent discount on the course thank you